Are you intrigued by downtown Miami and all the changes that are happening right now? Is this the right place for you to move into or invest? Will the properties and real estate in general increase in value over here? If you want to know that, you are in the right place. By the way, I am Stefania McGowan, your Miami and South Florida real estate agent. And if you're looking to buy, sell, or invest in downtown Miami or any other neighborhood, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. All my information is gonna be down on the description box. Send me a text, send me an email, give me a call, and I'll be more than happy to help you make the move. And without further ado, let's start with this downtown Miami neighborhood tour. This neighborhood is where business, entertainment, and culture all come together. It's a very dynamic urban city with rich history and diverse population. And today is experiencing the major transformation in history. Downtown Miami is actually one of the oldest neighborhoods and it dates back to the 19th century where it was the nucleus of commerce but it wasn't until henry flagler's florida east coast railway that the city's fate took a dramatic turn nowadays we can see a mix of antique buildings with architecture of the 1900s but also ultra luxury buildings like 1000 museum and soon waldorf astoria residences and this will be miami's tallest tower and Miami's first super tall skyscraper and this is how downtown Miami skyline will look like. There are so many things to do here in downtown like culture, music, festivals, restaurants, but I have to start by the main landmarks here in downtown right between Biscayne Boulevard and the Bay. And it is right here where I am standing today, where we have the Museum Park, we have the Bayfront Park, Biscay Marketplace, Casillo Center, and all within walking distance. Now let's talk about transportation and accessibility. I have to say downtown is the most accessible neighborhood in the entire state of Florida. Why you ask? Well, you have so many options to get transportation. Some of them are Metro Rail, Metro Bus, Metro Mover, Tri Rail, Trolley, and my favorite one, Brightline. So you can basically go anywhere from downtown you can go south to coconut grove you can go to the airport you can go north to fort lauderdale boca raton west palm beach on the tri-rail and actually go now all the way to orlando without driving at all with the bright line so that's definitely an amazing location you also have bike rentals pedestrian friendly pathways and easy access to the i-95 highway from several points and right now we are in Miami World Center and this is an area that you need to be aware of because it is the largest urban development in the United States where you're going to be able to live, play and stay all in the same area. Here you're going to have different components of office, retail, hospitality, entertainment and residential all within these few couple of blocks. As you can see, this area is still under construction, but you're going to have name stores like Lululemon's, Raven, Sephora, which is already open, and plenty of restaurant options, sports bars, bowling, and everything for anyone in the family, for people that live here to enjoy, but also to bring in more tourism, which is going to help the economy. Some of the buildings that you're going to find here are Paramount Building, Miami World Tower, Legacy Hotel and Residences, Basel and Caoba. Right now we are in Flagler Street and I'm going to share with you footage of how this street looked like only a few years ago. There is a project called the beautification project of this street and as you can see barricades there, the project is not done yet. What they want to do is welcome all the business and people to come here to live, work and play 
all in the same area. Not only the city is investing into this project, but also major real estate investors are pouring hundreds of millions of dollars into commercial and residential space. Now let's move on with real estate pricing. These stats are as of May 2024, so keep that in mind. One bedroom, the medium lease price is $499,000. Closed sales for the past six months land at $427,000 medium sale price. Two bedroom units listed at medium $742,000. And the past six months of closed sales, the medium sale price stays at $660,000. So if you're thinking of buying or investing, please keep in mind that there are ultra luxury buildings in this neighborhood as well as pretty old buildings that I believe it's also a really really good opportunity for investment and even if you're thinking of flipping or renovating there are plenty of opportunities in this neighborhood with really wide price points and this has been all for today in this Miami downtown neighborhood tour now, if you ask me, I personally believe downtown is the new brickle opportunity when it comes to growth in economics and real estate. So if you're looking to buy, sell, rent or invest here or in any other neighborhood in Miami, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. My name is Stefania Mogollon and all my information is going to be down on the description box. Send me a text, give me a call, send me an email and I'll be more than happy to help you make the move.